we headed? Tarker's Mill. to it take some sense. tear and fuck some shit up we're too late engine is already here oh shit what do we do stop the truck We're actually going. We're actually going to the fire. Even down there, my home. Dusk. Stay out of this. Wait. Call. Dude, this fuck with the man's home. Oh. Rip your fucking head off. Rodko. Oh, Rodko, they've cleared our northern line. They have an exo. We'll take care of the wounded later. We have to stop them. Let's go. Move. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, it looks badass. The I, 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 edge. This one. I could take that. Huh. Right. Holy shit. Got it. Huh. Clever boy. Fucking silver. Tell me, where's Adana? Don't worry, Kahal. Your daughter didn't fight this battle. How are your wounds? Riddled with silver. I'll take days to heal. But things would have been far worse if you hadn't stepped in. I just did what I had to do. Nothing more. I honestly never thought I'd see your face again. Why'd you come back, Cahal? Oh, that's what attack. Right. I was worried about Adana. When I heard the Cairn was being targeted, I had to come back for her. You know I couldn't stay. Not after what I did to Rafiq. I told you that your rightful place was at my side. And what you had done could be forgiven. But no. You chose to abandon us. Me, the Cairn, your daughter. That's for the Where British is she mark. not go? With Ava. Working undercover at the biggest entrance site in the Pacific Northwest. Best option available to us after the failure of our last mission. Question. Mission? Your last mission? What do you mean? You remember the old abandoned mine not far from here? Indran bought it 
and turned it into a training center for their new recruits. I launched an attack to wipe them out, but Tank Girl stopped us. The woman you saw in the exo during the attack, she drove us back. Tank Girl, you call her. I encountered her during my last mission. She was trying to buy silver bullets from an arms dealer. That's where I learned she was planning an attack on the Cairn. Major Grainer. That's the name her men give her. But to us, she's Tank Girl. And she leads Endron's troops with about as much grace. Their attack on the Cairn was their first wave of revenge for our attack on the training center. We managed to repel them this time. But it's only a temporary victory. They might return at any moment. And Endron just keeps recruiting soldiers. Then we've got to go back to the mine and destroy their training center. It's the only way to buy the Cairn any sort of safety. No matter how brief. Go back? No. Not until I'm well again. Then we can strike. Yeah. At least I could do. I'll just offer some help. I'll take care of that goddamn training center myself. You know I can handle it on my own. No. You're no longer a part of this pack. It's my responsibility. And how long will it take for you to get there? Days? Weeks? If they return, the cairn will fall. Huh. I'll think about it. Go pay your respects to your Fen and come back to me. Then we'll talk about the mine. Pay your respects to your friend. Hey, Kahal. It's good to see your face again. My son. They killed my son. Up He's lost prosperous. a lot of blood. I don't know if he'll make it through the night. Has anyone told his Damn, this boy got to tear the fuck she, up. She's gone. She bled out just before they shot him. Marco can't make any progress on the biofuel. Armand owns the exclusive patent and its composition is secret within the company. Nobody in Arena's team has any information on it. We have to go and get the data directly from the lab servers. But the place is highly is under high security. And you can't go there without the risk of her being detected. And I can't help her. We have to find a way of getting our hands on that data. We'll return to that current soon to talk to you about about it, Ava. This letter must have been sent just before the attack on the Cairn. Cairn? Oh, so is that. The Cairn is in a bad way. Uh, so could I do? Dusk, what are you doing here? I thought I told you to keep clear. You really thought I'd leave you behind like that? You should know me better than that by now. Besides, looks like you need all the help you can get. And I really don't want to lose my front row tickets to the Cajal show. That helps. Thanks, Dusk. Okay, yeah. No. Thanks sounds real weird coming out of you. Put that shit away. <laughs> well, if you really want to help. I'll go look after the injured. I rang the weather stormers and asked them to lend us a hand, too. Don't worry about me. You just do what you gotta do. Let's do what I do. Alright, let's look around. Uh, what's up? Can I talk to you? Oh, no, I can't. Okay. Where's the glide? Oh, shit. Arisen. Good to see you made it through okay. Thanks, and no small part to you. I'm glad you came back, all. Lambda Mankind really helped us out, too. We're lucky to have them with us. Let's look around. Agnes didn't even know how to fight. He was a spirit healer, a oh, caretaker Marcus. of children. Shit. Endron doesn't show anyone this. Endron. Seriously. Except he's Endron. I keep saying Endron. Oh, oh, Endron. <laughs> she was in the back, tending to the wounded. It's all. What's that? It has been many a year since I last found your presence, warrior of Gaia. 
It's been nearly as long since anyone called me that. Your care needs you, and the wild has need of your protection. The Eater of Souls is fighting with all his might to take control of it. And he is winning. The corruption takes many forms, but the effects are always the same. You must help us fight back. Parker's mill looks nothing like it did when I left. Yet you still protected the forest with everything you had. Your strength, your aura. What happened to them? As Gaia weakened, so too do I. The Anglings, the Jaglings, the Gafflings, they all suffer in kind. The Eater of Souls tries to corrupt them. But they're minor spirits. They are every bit as important as you or I. But in my weakness, I must look on, powerless to act, as they disappear. Which is why we need your help. You must help me to combat the worm, to protect the wild. I came back to find my daughter. Have you seen her? Ah, Adana. A dear friend, and always respectful of nature. You fear for her safety, then? She, too, is fighting for Gaia in her own way. But do not worry. You both walk the same path. You will find each other in time. To fight your battles, you will need power. Power I can provide by helping you develop your warrior gifts. Thank you, Ifen. You may find lost spirits during your travels. Return them to me, and I will be able to strengthen your natural abilities. One last request before you depart. Many of your kin fell in combat. I would ask you to bury them. You will find their bodies both inside and around the cairn. Your penumbra vision will show you the way. Through their souls and send them to me so that they may travel to the wild without being captured by the worm. I will if I can, but my priority is Endrin's training center. Weaken the forces of the worm there, but never forget your brothers and sisters. Gaia needs you. Oh, that's right. Your friend? That's, I think that's his name. Damn, how did that? Okay, I only see him in my imagination. I was saw him like when he's, he, he, yeah, he definitely sticks out if I were to pass by him or overlook him. So he's a creature with the human body, trees, uh, leaf skin, and uh, the. I think it was that, was that uh, stack of hay he used as his face and a glowing uh, energy. No, it's been alright. It's a mythical creature. But she was pregnant. They knew it too. The fuckers laughed about it as they did it. 
Chronicles are mostly from Russia. The Silver Fangs accords significant importance to the purity of their bloodline, as long as their ancestors and traditions. Natural leaders, the Silver Fangs have for many years taken the role of chief in Western packs. However, since the bloodline was has we, has weakened, the Silver Fang has drawn to themselves rare are those who who are now cross the Europe. Real mountains to lead the fight for Guy in the West, despite the slow demise of their tribe. Silver Fang has kept their nature and hero temp temperament the final testimony to their golden age. Bold and heroic. I hope Rodko's changed his mind. Oh my god, can I go in this? Be unstoppable if I can go in this. Alright, Rocco. <laughs> Coincidence that you and I, you, you and I have the same name, Rocco. <laughs> Rocco, Roku. <laughs> Alright, stock. I went to see Finn. Finn. He's gotten so weak. Please, Rotka, let me help you. Let me deal with this training center. Why is it that you care now, Kahal? We were so easy to ignore when we went right in front of you. What? You want to be part of the pack again? I want to help the pack. I want to protect Adana. But you don't intend to rejoin us. I've already given in to rage and killed one of our kin, Rotko. I can't take the risk of doing it again. You already know I disagree. Nonetheless, we are united by those we mourn. So I'll accept your help. Uh, let's, not, let's, not, let's dig in, find out more. Uh, for my daughter. Education. Tell me about Adana. Have you trained her? Just as I promised you, I made her into a warrior. I taught her everything she needed to fight, to defend herself, so that we wouldn't see a repeat of the tragedy that befell Ludmilla. Sure. About her first change. Has she gone through her first change yet? Not yet. And despite all my training, she never showed much inclination toward the wild side of things. She preferred to spend her time with Ava, studying humans, technology, and infiltration. To walk in Ludmilla's footsteps. That's right. No, it's not my way of doing things. It certainly paid off. She has proved to be. An exceptional spy. Rest assured, though, Adan is just as much Garo as you or me. Her first change will come in time, no matter what path she chooses to take. So back. Tell me about Ava. How's she doing? When you went into exile, she succeeded you as my lieutenant. She was ready and willing. It was hardly a smooth transition. I was forced to make some concessions. I can imagine. There are a lot of humans in the Cairn. A lot more than when I was here. Ava's Lambda Mankind. I'd heard about her group of activists. They're actually getting a lot of attention at the moment. Not sure if that's the best thing for the pack. That's what I thought too, at first. I can't uh, at first. So you've changed your mind about humans? That's a surprise. A lot of things have changed in the past five years. Myself included. For the longest time, I never trusted humans. But then I saw how they fought. How they stood strong for what they believed in. I saw their potential. Even I had to admit that Ava was right. The humans have been stalwart allies in our fight for Gaia. Now you've seen firsthand what Indran is doing to us. Our ranks grow thinner every year. Ava's humans aren't afraid to put their lives on the line for their planet. What more could I ask for? So what can you tell me about this so-called training, training center. center? Ava managed to get a hold of the mine blueprints to help us prepare for our previous attack. The site's weak point is its power supply. 
they apparently haven't had the time to give it a proper upgrade. The whole thing is powered by one big propane tank, just like it was when it was a mine. I see. So if I blow up the tank, the whole mine will cave in, taking the training center with it. Then we'll need explosives. You'll be happy to know I didn't come back empty-handed. I'm aware. I met your new friend... Dusk, right? He gave me the explosives you two stole. We've still got a problem, though. You don't know the layout of the site, and I'm too injured to go with you. Huh. I don't like touching the stuff, but I suppose I'll use Ava's radio equipment to guide you. That should do the trick. Perfect. So we'll stay in radio contact. Take the explosives and go. Good luck, Kahal. Collect this. Collect the explosives. Here. Dusk, my friend. I owe you. I need to enlist. You hear the internal motto around here? I just kind of walk around and take that in this quick form. The cost of the fine is always less than the cost of compliance. <laughs> Bingo. Won't see that one in their ads. You here to enlist? Yeah. I hear you've been having some trouble lately. Let's go to flow. You hear correctly. We were attacked a few days ago. We pushed them back, but let's just say we're a little understaffed right now. What's in this training program of yours anyway? That's nah, classified. But those who survive their training become real killing machines. With real thick wallets, too. What do you say? You interested? Uh... I tell the truth? Yes. Absolutely. That's yeah, the spirit. Did you register on our website? Nah, I prefer to do things in person. Can't say I blame you. What's your name? Kahal Philin. Kahal Philin. Hell of a name. There you go. You're on the list. All right, then. Go report to the instructor for testing. He's in the warehouse. Oh, and one last thing. Looking at you, it's pretty obvious you've done some time. Try not to mention that. The instructor hates ex-cons. This way. Control, I've got a candidate for you. All right, then. All right. All right, then you come pretty Welcome. smooth. If you're looking to sign up, you have to talk to the instructor. Head over to that building in the courtyard. Caught one of Endron's new ads on TV last night. They've even got a brand new slogan. Greener action serving the biosphere. Damn. There's nothing they won't bring. Tell me about it. Alright, let's select the thing. I'm here to be recruited. You! <laughs> How'd you make it through the physical without breaking a hip? All right, Gramps. Let me just find you on the list here. I signed up at the entrance. Kahal Fillin. Ah, right. Here you, you are. Look. Now let's get down to business. You ready for the interview? 
Yeah, sure, why not? Let's start with a technical question then. Our assault troops are equipped with a new type of pump action rifle. What kind of sight is it equipped with? No, I'm sorry. Pump actions don't have sights. Wrong. They have a holographic sight. But I understand why you'd get that wrong, Grandpa. Back in your day, they probably still had bayonets. Let's Bro. talk Endrin now. The company has an internal motto for those in the know. Can you tell me what it is? Greener today for a brighter Guess. tomorrow. Look around, you dumbass. Do you think Endrin gives a shit about going green? That's just the swill we serve the masses. Okay, enough of this paper pushing bullshit. I know a combat vet when I see one. I Welcome kill to the right training program. Head over to the waiting room. Someone will come get you new recruits in a few minutes. Understood. Oh fuck! Oh, that, that's so enraged. So you managed to get through their test just like that. Well done. But they want to make you wait. We don't have time for that. You should see a command post overlooking the waiting room. They'll have a computer inside and a service door leading into the mine. That computer will allow you to open the service door and cut communications with the lower floor. And the people here won't know what's going on in the training center. This one looks good though, which one? Which one? Go. I was getting y'all.
start drawing training site. Okay. Are we in a basement somewhere? Oh, in a shooting range. Okay. I'm in the mine. The propane tanks at the center of the site. There should be a service door that leads there. Take the time to watch one of our training sessions, which you can see through the window behind me. Okay, I'll try to sneak up on this guy. Is it your, this is all your fault? You could have done the easy way. I know it sounds like that. All right, I already killed the mountains. Let's save with that. Oh, they didn't hear all, didn't hear all that? I see the tank. That's good. They're injecting something into their recruits. We're aware. Entrance soldiers reek of the worm. We've been trying for weeks to figure out just what's in that fucked up shit. Yeah, fucked up shit. That's locked. 
How long will it be before our latest batch of recruits is trained? Two months for most of them. Less for the ones who react well to the serum. Excellent. I'll communicate that to me. Oh, I got to take care of. So the injections have something to do with the worm. Training. Oh, there's a lot of fucked up shit. There's silver here. Lots of it. Lots of silver. It smells overwhelming. You must be in their armory. The propane tank's downstairs from you. Soldier guarding it. He's more monster than man. Just muscles stacked on muscles. One of their elite soldiers. One way or another, you're gonna have to deal with him. <laughs> muscles on muscles. I can take him. I can take him. If it could be someone in an exosuit, I could take him. Security's detected an intruder. He's not going anywhere now that we've got the site locked down. Stay on your guard. Put a bullet in. Oh, 
I want him all to my, I want the big mouth to myself. Save him for the dessert. Set the explosives. There we go. The explosives are in place. Time for you to get out of there. Can you see me? It's all crouching. I got my stomach up. Always my hand, always my hand. I'm gonna get your ass with him. I think I made some from all your shit.
Search the warehouse. If you find the intruder, don't try yeah. to. <laughs> Latest on the program. The flamethrower exos have just cleared testing. Just got the green light for their deployment. Good. Keep <laughs> Terminal. I'm almost at the control room. Let 
Man, these soldiers? I ain't gonna get all killed, see. systems down. just arrived back at the cairn and brought your daughter with her. Hedana. Hedana. Alright. We're dead. Dad and daughter reunion. Imagine you'd like to see your daughter before anything else. She'll be in Ava's quarters, I'm sure.
nobody here. But her computer's on. Old notes from Ava, before she created Lambda Mankind. My Irish brethren, but that was a lifetime ago. You know I hate it when people mess with my stuff. That's an impressive amount of equipment. It's the bare minimum for leading a handful of activists against a megacorp like Indran. Haven't changed much, have you? Aside from a couple of new lines on your face. <laughs> Thanks, asshole. You know, I always knew you'd come back. It was just a matter of when. This isn't quite the reunion I had in mind. But it's a happy one. I heard about your handiwork at the mine. Adana. Kahal?